our right to be able to be open. The Black Diamond Bar reopened on Friday. Business was initially a little slow, but as word spread, it didn't take long before people were steadily coming in. Every single day, there's, there's multiple, you know, dozens and dozens of people that want to stop, shake my hand, or give me a hug, which I allow, um, thanking me for opening. Phase two of Governor Inslee's plan to reopen the state hasn't started yet. This phase will allow restaurants to reopen their dine-in areas. But Brandon Fenton, the co-owner, says their finances, like many other local businesses, were tight. It will be a breaking point for us very soon, and we didn't want to wait until we were at that breaking point. He says he's supporting other local businesses also deciding to reopen early. The more of us that open, the less likely that you know they, anybody's going to do anything or try to abuse any power to shut us down. Corporal Mark Gregory with the Spokane County Sheriff's Office says he is aware the Black Diamond has reopened, but law enforcement isn't rushing to give out citations or arrest people. Enforcement will be the first step, which is education. And we will continue to do that to work with our businesses to get them to understand the possible ramifications for not only public safety, but for also their business in the future. Expecting an explanation as to what legal right they have to pull my license, any license, whether it be health department, liquor license, business license, whatever it is, there has to be some reasoning, some law, some regulation that I'm violating that they can use to do that. Gregory says he'll be contacting the business, letting them know they are violating the governor's orders. But in the meantime, the Black Diamond is operating at 50% capacity. All of our pool tables, all the pool sticks, pool balls, um, bridges, menus, our flyers, everything are all getting pulled. You have to go up to the bar to get them. We sanitize in between each customer that's using them. They're the same precautions they would be taking during phase two of Governor Inslee's plan, but the owners got an early start. It just seems kind of ridiculous that we have to stay closed when our numbers are so low. In Spokane Valley, Shana Walltower, Creme 2 News.